Nicole Letter, she was a French editor. She was not founding Nil Editions in 1993. She was born on 20th of February 1938, died on 31st of January 2023. Cause of death is known. She was 84. Robert Talva, he was an American film editor. He was nominated for the Academy Award for Best Film Editing for his work on The Black Stallion in 1979. Died on 27th of January 2023. Died from lymphoma. He was 80. Billy Packer, he was an American college basketball player, sportscaster, and author. He spent more than three decades working as a color analyst for television coverage of college basketball. Died on 26th of January 2023. Died of kidney failure. He was 82. Diana Fisher. She was an Australian journalist, television and radio presenter, social commentator, and royal correspondent. Died on 26th of January 2023. Died from lymphoma. She was 91. Victor Nowaski. He was an American journalist, editor, and academic. He was publisher emeritus of the Nation and George D. Delacroix Professor Emeritus. Died on 3rd of January 2023. Died from pneumonia. He was 90. Queen Lab, she was an American sports journalist. During a career as a sports writer, she wrote for newspapers including the Philadelphia Inquirer, the San Francisco Examiner, and the New York Times. Died on 20th of January 2023. Died from lymphoma. She was 61. Jerry Blavatt, he was an American disc jockey and performer, who had been a major influence in promoting all this music on the radio. Died on 20th of January 2023. Died from myasthenia gravis. He was 82. Ted Bell, he was an American author of such famous novels such as How an Assassin, Pirate and Spy. Died on 20th of January 2023. Died from hemorrhage stroke. He was 76. Don Campbell. He was an American film editor with more than three dozen feature film credits. His editing of *Romancing the Stone* was nominated for an Academy Award for Best Film Editing along with fellow editor Frank Morris. Died on 18th of January 2023. Died from a fall. He was 93. Edward R. Pressman, he was an American film producer and founder of the production company Edward R. Pressman Film Corporation. Died on 17th of January 2023. Died from respiratory failure. He was 79. Arjun Pons, he was a Dutch journalist. Pons started his journalist career at Kui and Emlander, where his mother worked. Died on 17th of January 2023. Died from cancer. He was 53. Van Connor. He was an American rock musician, best known as the bassist for his Screaming Trees. Died on 17th of January 2023. Died from pneumonia. He was 55. Louise Boulanger, she was a Swiss poet, actress, and television producer. She was born in Bangkok on 3rd of November 1926. Died on 16th of January 2023. Cause of death is not revealed. She was 96. Bruce Cowers, he was a British television director and producer. Best known for his work on large-scale live music and event productions, 
died on 15th of January 2023, died of an acute respiratory infection. He was 82. David Onley, he was a Canadian broadcaster and author who served as the 28th Lieutenant Governor of Ontario from 2007 until 2014. Died on 14th of January 2023, died of brain tumor, he was 72. Thomasina Winslow, she was an American blues musician and the daughter of folk musician Tom Winslow. In addition to her solo career, Winslow has been a member of four bands. Died on 13th of January 2023, died from a stroke. She was 57. Country boy Addy, he was an American singer, instrumentalist and radio and television personality. He was the host of the Country Boy Addy show on WBRC. Died on 13th of January 2023, now because of the task given, he was 92. Black Hawn Shell, he was an American journalist and editor who worked for the New York Times, Politico and Foreign Policy. Died on 10th of January 2023, he was 44 years old. Dick Flood, he was an American country music singer, songwriter. In the mid 1950s, he was part of the duo The Country Lads and made regular appearances on CBS The Jimmy Dean Show. Died on 9th of January 2023, died of pulmonary edema, he was 90. Roisman. He was an American cinematographer. He received five Academy Award nominations for Best Cinematography for the films The French Connection and others. Died on 6th of January 2023. Died after a long illness. He was 86. Lou Hunter. He was an American screenwriter, author and educator. He was chairman emeritus and professor of screenwriting at the UCLA Department of Film and Television. Died on 6th of January 2023. Died from COVID-19. He was 87. Hans Grissemann, he was an Austrian radio host, journalist and actor. He began his career in radio in 1954 with Center Crap West in the French occupation of Austria. Died on 6th of January 2023. Now because of the task given, he was at the age. Pierre Jarson, he was a Belgian film director and screenwriter. He had started his career as an assistant to Jane Mary Degas-Wess. Died on 4th of January 2023. Now because of the task given, he was 74 years. Arthur Duncan, he was an American tap dancer, also called an entertainer's entertainer, known for his turn as a performer on the Lawrence Wack show. Died on 4th of January 2023, died of a stroke, he was 97. Sergi Chef, he was a Spanish television producer and director for the television Espanola. He worked for the corporation for six years on programs including the game show Saber Y Canal. Died on 3rd of January 2023. Now because of the task given, he was 85. Kajda Thor, she was a Swedish journalist and television presenter who was employed by the Swedish television in the 1990s. She was born on 2nd of June 1971. Died on 2nd of January 2023. Cause of his now, she was 51. Frank Lartey, he was an American director, writer and actor. He was a member of a Steppenwolf Theatre Company and an associate director at Goodman Theatre. Died on 2nd of January 2023. Died from cancer, he was 79. 